So I'm out foraging about and I just wanted to show you all a uh, look at sassafras, a native wild spice that we have. So you can see there's a mitten shaped leaf and there's a three prong leaf. All right here's the mitten. And then there's a regularly shaped leaf. So the sassafras has three kinds of leaves, which is very unique for this plant. This, uh, as well, you can see the bark, which is very significant. Brownish green, and getting greener, greener, greener as you go up. Now where my fingers are, you see it's extremely green. Uh, this plant is a wonderful spice, healing, nutritive medicine was used actually uh, it's a treatment for syphilis uh, in the old times and became so popular apparently that people felt judged and they stopped drinking it. Um, sassafras was used by native indigenous people as a food spice as well as a medicinal tea. Uh, the leaves are filet powder which actually in uh, the south, in Louisiana, etc. is used in gumbo as a soup thickener so that was probably very common of native people of North America. The twigs are a great chew stick, antiseptic for the gums, etc. And uh, the roots, of course, are a root beer, but you'd kill the plant if you harvested it. So be very mindful when you're harvesting sassafras roots that you're being regenerative and sustainable. Sassafras is a wonderful healing plant that is in our ecosystem it only exists as a result of people caring to preserve forests. So, sassafras, a wonderful medicinal, relatively easy to find.